1937 in New York. Times were tough, but even in the midst of the Great Depression, there was still nothing like spring to give even the gloomiest naysayers a pep in their step. It was Easter Sunday. Bonnets, chicks, chocolate eggs, all the usual stuff, which is what made the discovery at the Gideon apartment so awful. Papa. Hello, dear. Good to see you. On Easter Sunday in 1937, Ethel Kudner and her husband Joe arrive at her mother's apartment in Beekman Place on the east side of Manhattan. They're not answering. Oh, no. And her father, Joseph Gedeon, is already there. Joseph Gedeon is separated from his wife, but they were going to have dinner as a family. Ah, you see? The door's open. Ma! They discover the naked body of Veronica Gedeon, Ethel's younger sister, and uh, Joseph's daughter. <laughs> Where's mother? <laughs> they go around the apartment, and they're looking for Mary. Oh, no. In another bedroom, they find the body of their boarder, a man named Frank Burns, an Englishman and he has been stabbed multiple times in the head and neck. Oh, my God. Where's mother? Maybe she went to get help. But they still can't find Mary Gideon. They immediately call the police. Police look around and notice that there's something underneath the bed. The body of Mary Gedeon, Joseph's wife, and Ethel's mother. We found another body that's Mary. Joseph Gedeon takes the news with surprising calm. 